In this class we are going to simulate the vapor compression refrigeration cycle on the S Pen Plus and in the end we are going to calculate the COP of the cycle. So let's first understand what is vapor compression refrigeration cycle. So it has a compressor which compresses the vapor coming from the evaporator. So the high pressure vapor is then sent to the condenser where heat is rejected to the surrounding converting the vapor into the liquid then high pressure liquid is sent to the expansion valve where your isenthalpic expansion of the liquid take place and then that liquid is sent on the send to the evaporator where your heat is absorbed from the sink so this is your typical single stage vapor compression refrigeration cycle so the question is we have to simulate the vcrc on the s pen plus so for that we have to use the method ref prof and refrigerant is r32 ch2 f2 so mass flow rate is given so we have to calculate the cop so i have calculated it by hand okay now your compressor is working at 25 bar pressure and your expansion valve is at 6 bar ok now let's go to the S Pen Plus so first we have to input the component so our component is CH2 CH2 F2 so this is our refrigerant R32 so method used is ref prop so s pen plus is a very good tool to understand the flow rate and cop of the cycles so now we will go to the simulation environment first part is your s4 stream so we can input so it is coming at 25 degrees celsius and one bar pressure mass flow rate is given that is 1000 then it is sent to the evaporator so it is compressed Now we connect all the streams to the components. So your compressor is working at so we can see twenty five bar. So condenser your vapor fraction is 0 and your pressure is not changing around the across the condenser so click next so evaporator also 
your pressure is not changing across the your operator and your vapor fraction is 1 so outlet pressure of the valve is 6 bar as given in the question now everything is completed then we can run the simulation so results are available as you can see at the down left bottom okay so but this is not the cycle so what we can do we can delete this stream s5 stream and connect this s4 to the wall now reset and rerun the simulation so results are available we can see the vapor fraction we can see the pressure so work and heat and the mass flow rate as you can see mass flow rate is in kg per hour pressure is in bar okay so this is your condenser So this is your vapor compression refrigeration cycle. So you can analyze the results. So you can go to the result summary and then streams. Now you can see so vapor fraction across the this your mm, S1 is what? okay across the compressor s1 to s s1 to s2 is 1 and then s2 to s3 is 0 so here all the vapor is converted to the liquid and then from s3 to s4 this is your vapor fraction in the stream then all this is converted to vapor again in the evaporator mm, correct as you can see now you can find out the now you can find out the COP by using this enthalpy flow so we will convert it into megawatt that will be easier and if you see the formula so your formula is h1 minus h4 upon h2 minus h1 so this the, this is the enthalpy of h1 stream enthalpy of h4 stream and then h uh, enthalpy of h2 minus enthalpy of h1 so we will get it from here and if we calculate this we will get a result of COP of 2.879 ok so now this is how you do the VCRC in the S Pen Plus ok now you can change the uh, change your flow rate and your different pressures and see what will be the effect on the uh, this um, you know, COP or your fraction vapor fraction uh, after the valve so all this you can uh, you can then simulate in this ok let's change one thing if you change the pressure across the valve what will happen so if I say it is 10 now so it is 2 bar pressure after the wall ok now you can see so the results are different now ok 
okay so your fraction change vapor fraction after the valve changes from 2.0.28 to 0.37 so your okay now your answer will also change cop will also change you can calculate it and then see the change so this is how you simulate this vcrc in the s pen plus hope you like my video if you have any queries or any questions you can contact me in the given email which i have provided under my channel okay if you want to learn s pen plus then also you can contact me if you want to do any questions on the s pen plus then also you can contact me so i hope you like my video Thank you. Take care.